Dr. Mahata demonstrated that the thickness of the graft was a key part of the success. The 8 millimeter thick graft restored stability and decreased peak acromial pressures. The fascia lata autograph is the key to the success in the SCR because of its excellent healing biology. Thickness we know is important. You must compress to make a stiff graft and you must include the IMS which adds thickness and stiffness. Here's an example of a finished graph. And now I'm going to flip it over while you're doing the video. And then, and then one more thing I'm going to do is we're going to, show, we're going to show the width. Yeah, we open one more. Which is about seven or eight right there. And now we're going to show the stiffness. Great, thank you. The graft retear rate for a thick and stiff fascia lata autograft with intermuscular septum is very low, as low as 10%. Our study has reached 11.8%, as opposed to the dermal autograft, which can be very high, 62% or higher. Proper graft choice and preparation is the key to success with SCR. Learning how to harvest the graft from the fascia lata is the first key step to creating the right graft. Here is our operating room setup in lateral position. Okay. Here's a close-up of the left upper thigh. Note the circle is the greater trochanter. This is a right hip with the left side being the greater trochanter. And here we are marking the graft outline and harvesting the graft. And you can see the intermuscular septum quite well. Marked with the three asterisks. Repairing the intermuscular septum with interrupted orthochords in figure of eight is an important step. Then we begin the repair of the harvest site with interrupted sutures and eventually close it to the greater trochanter, retentioning the gluteus and the ITB. Here on the left hip, we've closed the skin with a running 3-0 monocryl subcuticular after closing the dead space and injecting a long-acting anesthetic. This keeps tension off the skin edges and we cover it with an Aquacel dressing, which we take off at about 10 to 12 days. We're taking the dressing down, we're looking, this is a beautiful looking wound, look at that. That looks beautiful. Here at three weeks, the skin is healed well. The star designates the greater trochanter region and there's no swelling on this particular healing. Here's an excellent example of a harvested fascia lata with intermuscular septum. Uh, you'll see the intermuscular septum marked with the three asterisks. The one asterisk is the greater trochanter side, which tends to be thicker. This will be folded into an excellent graft uh, once it's completed. With the graft processed and compressed, you can see the thickness is adequate and the stiffness is very good and leads to excellent healing and restoration of the acromial humeral distance. Looking at our right shoulder and show me your forward flexion all the way up. Both arms if you would. That's terrific. Okay, now turn and face the chart and reach behind you and show me how we're doing there. Very, very good. Thank you.